Hi, everyone. It's obvious that we live in a time that is so uncertain. And a lot of us are wondering what we can do uh, for the conflict, for all of the hatred that's flying around the world politically, all the division, all the things that are tearing us apart. We hear so much rhetoric, and yet so little true action is being taken to bring us together, to find a common good. And I think in the end, if it's going to happen at the top, it has to happen through each one of us. We all need to become the next Gandhi. And that doesn't necessarily mean that we need to, to do something as huge and as big as Gandhi or Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. But we need to, each one of us, be the change that we want to see in the world, just as Gandhi said. We have to live this in small, ordinary ways. Maybe if we were to do that, then the politicians that seem to be the problem really will find their own place behind each one of us who are claiming to be the solution. I really believe that that's what could happen. That's my dream. And so I want to fall back into that quote of Gandhi, be the change that you want to see in the world. Be the change. Be the change that you want to see. change be the change that you want to see in this world train your mind on who you are not who you want to be open your eyes to what's in front of you, then you'll finally see, then you'll see, to be the change, be the change, that you want to see, in this world, just be the change. So here's the call to be the change as Gandhi was and as you can be right now. I'm James Twyman, and it's such a pleasure to be part of this world when we come together in this way. Thank you for being part of this new movement.